Hi, I'm Dr. Steve Scurro. I want to welcome you to Terrasan's introductory series on musculoskeletal ultrasound. First and foremost, this series is not designed as a comprehensive review of musculoskeletal ultrasound. Rather, as mentioned, it is intended as an introduction to musculoskeletal ultrasound and those who are relatively new to this procedure. These videos are not peer-reviewed, and you should use caution before applying any of the techniques learned in these videos to your patients, as you are ultimately responsible for their well-being. Thank you. In this first introductory video, I'd like to start with some very basic things. The first thing we're going to start with is actually how to hold the probe, because it's very important to obtaining a good image in ultrasound is that you have proper control of the probe. In teaching this over the years, I've noticed that a lot of people like to hold the probe something like this. When you do that and you place the probe on the person, it's very likely to slide and slip around. So the proper way to hold the probe is a bit like a pencil. You're going to hold the probe something like this. When you place the probe on the person, try to place at least one finger or two down on the patient to stabilize your hand, like so. We have to use adequate amounts of gel in order for ultrasound to penetrate the skin. So we want to make sure that we apply plenty of ultrasound gel either to the probe or to the patient. As we discussed earlier, holding the hand properly is very important. So I want to make sure that I get my hand down on the patient to control the ultrasound probe. Continuing with the probe basics, or this is also called a transducer, transducer basics, you should be aware that there is a notch on the probe. The notch on the probe aligns to the left side of the screen. When you're first learning to perform an ultrasound examination, it's very helpful if you position the ultrasound machine such that your left eye is to the not side of the probe and to the screen. This way, when you move the probe to the left side, the image will be moving towards the left, and when you move to the right, you'll be moving to the right.